welcome to my review on the Orca Triton Series Kayaks. Uh, how I got introduced to these kayaks, I've been using them for quite some time, kayaks to fish kayaks and orca, um, both from the same manufacturer. And I came across one of these because that was a cheap kayak and I wanted to get one to paddle because I'm used to using pedal powered Hobies for over 10 years. And I was very impressed with what I saw and um, next thing you know, a few months down the track, I found myself being a dealer. So now I'm looking at the Triton Double, which is also an impressive looking kayak, but I want to take you through what I think are the pros and the cons, because even though I'm a dealer, I still want to give you my honest opinion. So here's my review on the Orca Triton Series Kayak. The first thing you want to take a look at is when looking at a kayak is the overall appearance. And to say this looks impressive is an understatement. These come in four awesome colors and every single one of those colors are really, really good on the eye and something that you'd like to be seen on the water with. That's one of the things that really makes these kayaks stand out. One other thing I really like is the design. Now, if you look down below, I've got like a tri hull. And as you can imagine, after testing, I found that these go really well through the water. Now these kayaks come with four hatches. So as you can see, it's got one hatch here, one down below the front passenger seat, and then a big one down at the back. This one's what you'd probably use for putting in more significant things. Now you can buy proper hatches that fit in there, like containers where you can have a solid bottom one thing I didn't like about the design was having that hatch under the second seat. But the reason they do this is because this seat can move up to here and you can fit another seat behind it. So it actually can have a kid's seat. So you can fit three seats in here. So if you did move this one forward, you got access to that hatch. But if you move that seat forward, then you don't have the leg room. So even though they design it as a three seater, I honestly think that you're losing leg room. It's probably great if you've got two kids and an adult, but yeah, this, this, so the only thing is that this would probably would have been better done here. So you'd have all your storage behind the driver's seat or the captain and the guy in the back also have access. So that's one of the cons I've found about this kayak. As you can see, they also come with these mountable rod holders, you get two. So, see these railings that go along here? It's awesome that they've got one here, one here, and two on the other side. Lots of cool little extras can go in there. You can put camera mounts. Um, I've also seen extra storage solutions, pouches for pliers and knives and things. Pretty awesome with the extras you can get. Yeah, the rudder system is controlled by the guy in the rear seat but I find that it's not even needed because you've got two persons you've got two people on here that can steer the rudder system will give you a bit more stability but really it's not even required because you can quite easily steer when paddling okay the back handle got a back handle and a front handle I find that the back handle would have been better if it had more of a, a handle piece here but really in the grand scheme of things it's still quite handy it's not really much of a con there overall for the uh, the pros of this kayak it far outweighs the cons really you've got uh, drink holders in the front here and the guy in the back has got room so that you could actually carry two beers. So obviously the guy in the back can drink more beer. So that's definitely a bonus. Uh, if you've got more room for, you know, maybe pliers in here or, or lures that you're not using, they're very handy. 
we've got two rod holders at the back these are probably your trolling ones and there's two at the front which are more designed for um, bottom fishing because they'll be pointing forwards so it's awesome you can have two rods trolling at the back if you get a double hook up the guy in the back can pass the rod to the guy in the front very awesome setup for for fishing for two people